On the 22nd of August, shortly after the fall of Kabul, Twitter user Alex Joshua posted a screenshot of an alleged Taliban member apparently falling for the oldest trick in the book. He asked what Ligma means. It's unconfirmed whether the supposed Taliban account is real or fake, but the fact remains that its existence raises many ethical questions. Will the presence of the Taliban on Twitter normalise the extremist group of people become used to their branding? And will they be sought out for their extreme content? After all, long have groups such as ISIS used the internet to radicalise people. It comes under the question of how Twitter responds to those posting from the perspective of a violent extremist group, and already Malung has been terminated for violating Twitter guidelines. Unfortunately, as soon as there are official Taliban members using the internet, there are others who would seek to use their violent brand. See you next time on Lessons in Internet Culture.